Waco Police Department held their third annual Back to School Bash on Saturday, July 28th at Richland Mall. Students and their families received school supplies, free haircuts, immunizations, and so much more. This year, the police department and local volunteers stuffed over 1,000 clear backpacks for students. A huge thank you to our police department, volunteers, donors, program partners, and especially our event partner, Richland Mall, for hosting the event. Let's continue to set up our kids for success in the upcoming school year. On Friday, July 28th, the Waco-McLennan County Public Health District celebrated the grand reopening of the WIC Clinic with the return of in-person services. The celebration included food trucks, face painting, games, balloons, and lots of family fun. Women, Infants, and Children, WIC, is a supplemental nutrition program for working and non-working families who meet income, residency, and health screening guidelines. Clinics provide nutrition counseling, food benefits for grocery stores, breastfeeding education, and nutrition education classes. To learn more about WIC, visit waco-texas.com slash WIC. On Monday, July 24th, Lieutenant Keith Guillory and the Waco Fire Department returned to the Mayborn Museum for their Summer Mystery Storytime series. It's a summer reading camp that the Mayborn Museum does, and we partner with them. We come in, we bring our fire trucks, we bring firefighters, um, we read to the little people, and just really promote literacy. So, so literacy is foundational. It's just important to you know not have that learning loss um, during the summertime. After story time, the firefighters had a show and tell with their gear, and the kids were able to explore the fire engine. In honor of the museum's summer exhibit, Scooby-Doo Mansion Mayhem, the Mayborn Museum is hosting a fun, mystery-filled story time each Monday through August 14th, featuring special guests from the Waco community. Check back later this summer for more Mystery Monday story times.